feel like particularly as a drummer and particularly as Broadway moves more towards pop music and music that grooves is, is, you know, there are creative decisions that, you know, a drummer, or any rhythm section player who has dedicated their life to making music groove, there can be a dissonance between that and the Broadway aesthetic, you know, um, where there's dancing and they might feel like the tempo needs to move, working in situations where, like, you know, I might be the only person in the rhythm section who ever played in a blues band or ever play, you know, and we're playing a blues number. I'm the only, you know, I'm the only person who's actually, you know, who's actually uh, played a funk gig, <laughs> you know, when we're playing a funk tune. And there are decisions that work for, you know, there are musical decisions that work for Broadway that would not work if you were at a club and you just want everyone to dance and feel good. Sometimes they line up. I mean, particularly, obviously, in like jukebox musicals, if you're playing like, you know, you know, Four Tops or you're playing Jersey Boys and you're playing, you know, you're just playing the pop tunes. That's one thing. But when you're playing someone's original music, there can be that dissonance where, you know, my instinct is like, well, this tune needs to be slower. And it, I just need to play the same thing. I need to play one and three on the bass drum and two and four on the snare drum and make it feel great. And and that might not be the Broadway um, way of doing things. And so I think part of being of service on these gigs is being like, OK, I'm going to do what they want, even though in to my ears, it doesn't sound like the best musical choice. But for, but it actually is the best musical choice because it's and I guess it's something I've had I had to learn is that. There are musical choices that make sense in a Broadway show that don't make sense anywhere, anywhere else in the, in the universe. But in this, you know, uh, universe of Broadway, it makes sense that this, this song suddenly out of nowhere has to speed up, you know, <laughs> <laughs> like that wouldn't make sense if you were in a in a club or on a, you know, in a dance gig or, you know, on a record. But it makes sense to the plot of the show and the movement of the show and the dancing. Thank you for watching the Broadway Drumming 101 YouTube channel. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell icon so that you'll be notified when a new video is released.